first I want to extend a big, beautiful welcome to those who are here. My name is Whitney, and I'll be walking you through this week's message. Now, the first thing I want you to do is look at this candle and feel with your heart as you inhale deeply which color is best for you. Are you feeling pink and light? Are we feeling blue and deep? Are we feeling both? Let's get into the message. Now, for those who chose the pink, let's see what your card is. So, Spirit, what is the message for those who chose the pink this week? Focus on the light. Those who chose pink, here is your guided message from Spirit. This week, Spirit wants to remind you that you are like a diamond and you are being put under pressure. See, the thing is, a lot of times when you're on your way to winning and when you are winning, you want to bring the people that you love with you. You want to see everybody win. You want to bring everyone on your team. And it's really hard for you to understand sometimes, those who chose pink, that not everyone has the same heart as you. Not everyone has the same loyalty as you. Not everyone sees things the way that you see things. Well, this week, Spirit is saying that we're calling you to see within. We're calling you to see you for everything that you are and everything that you're made of. And that you don't necessarily need the outside noise or the outside accolades as long as it's within. As long as you see you. As long as you know your gift, your power, your strength. And when you see that that light that we so divinely put into your spirit that we so divinely put into your being you will walk in it and when you walk in it no one will ever be able to deny you love light all good things will not be able to not to deny you because you are that you are a resemblance you are a mirror image of all good things and so this week allow yourself to be poured into by you allow yourself to be loved by you allow yourself to see yourself the way that spirit sees you you are on the verge of something great. All you have to do now is believe in yourself and believe that this moment was made for you and that this opportunity that's in front of you, your vision, your dream, the thing that lies so deep within your heart, your passion, it's for a reason. And so Pink, this week, it's about finding your power, owning it, and walking in it loudly, proudly, and unapologetically. Now for those who chose the blue, let's see what your card is. So Divine, what is the message for those who chose the blue today? After the storm. Now, for those who chose blue after the storm, let's get into your guided message. Spirit is saying that you've been on a bit of a roller coaster ride and that there's been certain things and certain people, places, opportunities that you did have to leave behind in 2022. But see, the thing about you is... You didn't necessarily want to have to let certain people, places, or things go, but you did it because you understood there's a bigger picture. You held on because you understood there's got to be a purpose. You held on because you chose faith over fear. Now, spirit is coming into your life and saying, listen, we have a new opportunity for you. All we need you to do is step through the door. All we need you to do is go to the other side. And we need you not to be afraid. We need you not to be scared. We need you to trust that the grass can certainly and will certainly be greener on the other side. See? There are certain things and certain people in your life that have went way past their expiration date. And when you let go of what is old and what is stagnant and what is dead, you will be reborn. You will be renewed. You will be lifted up. So don't think that the storm you endured is the storm you will endure. And look at it as a learning lesson because you are shedding dead weight. You are shedding unnecessary things. You are moving forward. And just as a snake sheds its skin and it's reborn into something wiser, something more mature, something that is forever and eternal, so are you. Your promise is still waiting for you. Walk in it. You deserve it. Don't be afraid to let go and let God. 